Well, one College Station man is not letting life hold him back despite a diagnosis of muscular dystrophy. Tonight, a Rebecca Fiedler talks to Kyle Cox, who's ready to hit the road. Today, I'm spending my afternoon with the Cox family of College Station in a very unique car. Kyle Cox is an Aggie alumnus, a recent Bush School graduate, and a licensed motorist. Kyle was born with Duchenne muscular dystrophy, which has created significant physical setbacks for him. But thanks to funding from the Texas Workforce Commission, he's been able to acquire customization for his car, which allows him the independence he needs to drive to work. The car allows Kyle to drive to church, to work at his family's technology business on the A&M campus, and to go to meetings for the business that Kyle aims to start. I just took my solo, a solo road trip a few months ago to Austin for the first time to visit the capital. So that was the first time I got to driven by myself. But I mean, I've driven to Dallas, I've driven to Houston, of course with other people in the car. I've even driven as far as El Paso. Kyle didn't just hop in the modified car and take off when he first acquired it in August of 2019. The vehicle had to be tested for safety by experts, and Kyle spent weeks of training ensuring he could operate it safely. The situation isn't without its challenges, though. The car system has malfunctioned and left Kyle stranded before. The Coxes say they'd like to see local vendors who service this type of system. Still, they're grateful for this advancement in technology. Going places like I've never gone before. Reporting in College Station, Rebecca Fiedler with Kyle Cox, KRHD News.